style. So spring is here and summer is right around the corner. So today I thought it'd be kind of fun to teach you guys how to add a nice little pop of color and a little bit of inspiration to your spaces by doing this one super simple, super easy, and bright and beautiful DIY. So let's get started. Here's what you're gonna need. Cardboard letters, a bunch of your favorite silk flowers, a block of styrofoam, a pair of wire cutters, a pair of scissors, a caulking knife, and a hot glue gun and some glue. I started by peeling off the back of the lining of all my letters. Using my scissors, I just finished it off and cut out the back completely. Now I could only find these mini letters, but you guys can use whatever size letters you want. I found mine at Michael's and they were on sale. Next, I lined up my letters on the styrofoam and traced them out with my caulking knife. You could also use a butter knife, even a spatula, whatever you have around the house will do. Then, I just trimmed the styrofoam to fit. Depending on how big your flowers are, it's a good idea to have the foam drop into the letter just a little bit. I'd say about a half an inch is perfect. If you have any spaces at the end, just squeeze in a smaller piece of styrofoam to fill in the gaps. As I was hollowing out the letters, I accidentally peeled off the side of one letter. But I actually preferred it that way because I wanted white letters from the beginning. So I just peeled off all of the black and it looked even better. Now the fun part, time for some color. Okay, so some of my silk flowers popped off really easily. And well, others, they took a little creative maneuvering to get them off. But if you have a good pair of wire pliers or scissors, that should do the trick. It's always a good idea to arrange all of your flowers first before gluing them down. Okay, so here's a quick tip. If the stems of your flowers are a little bit too flimsy, just use a toothpick or a bobby pin to make a starter hole for the stem. Once I had a general idea for where I wanted each flower, I put a dollop of hot glue on the stem and secured it on the letter. Just repeat this process for the rest of your letters, and voila! You will have a beautifully colorful, friendly greeting to decorate your room or door with. Well, that's it. So easy and so fun. Now, I chose to spell out the word hi because I want to put it on my door and I think that's really cute. But you guys could honestly spell out whatever word you want that's positive and happy and exciting. You could do this for a bridal shower. You could spell out the word love or joy or really anything. You can do your name. There's so many opportunities and so many different things you could do with this. It's so fun. Leave me a comment below with what word you guys are going to pick to flower bomb this summer. Tell me why, because I want to know. Like, is it going to be your girlfriend's name or your boyfriend's name? Maybe your cat's name? Maybe just a really fun word for a really fun party. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. If you liked today's video, be sure to leave it a thumbs up. And if you're not a subscriber, be sure to click right here and subscribe. If you do have some extra time on your hands, Take a look at this video, it's pretty awesome. It's gonna be somewhere over here. That is a braid video and that is another really cool DIY room decor option. And it's gonna blow your mind probably, so check them out. We'll see you next week. Jazz hands and perfect. <laughs>